and p.m. on WTLW, OG and Bath, both teams with week one wins, both with expectations for a winning season and a possible playoff run. Of course, Titans made it last year. Bath did not, losing on that second tiebreaker. Great night at the tub. It was a great night anywhere you went for high school football. OG third and short. They give it to Daniel Beamer in the first quarter, and he gets a first down. Then the Titans giving it to their other runner, who had a huge week last night. Last week, Connor Neese breaks it nicely outside for another Titan first down. OG, though, goes three and out, so they give it back to Bath. Caden Sullivan going to keep it. He breaks to the outside. How about a 55-yard pickup? Puts him in the red zone. But you might have seen that laundry fly. It is called back. So Sullivan trying to do it through the air. Finds Ryan Cobb over the middle for a huge play and a first down, but they would end up punting. Back here at Bath in the second quarter. Still 0-0. Caden Sullivan finds Cobb again. 30-yard strike, this time for the touchdown. 7-0 Bath. Titans looking to answer before the half. Jay Kaufman, after the Bath celebration, it's Jay Kaufman diving into the end zone to tie it at 7 and the Titans come from behind with a Titanic win. 24-13, Ken Schreiner's team starts WBL play 1-0, and they are also 2-0 overall.